Radio Raheem with the hands of stone. Roberto Duran, one of my favorite analysts in the game, because you know from a first hand what happens in the ring is uh, is so crucial in a rematch because both fighters have seen each other before. And knowing these two fighters, is there a particular adjustment that you believe Joshua can make to change the outcome of the fight tomorrow night? It's very crucial that it's a revancha. So, as you know, do you think there's a adjustment in particular that can be made by Joshua to win this fight? Well, I think that the two are good. But I think that if Joshua has to fight with him, tiene que bocearle, no fácil. Pelearle a los lados, usa mucho el jab. Y cuando el otro viene a atacarlo, porque veo en la foto se ve que eh, el, el, el moreno se ve que es más alto. Usa mucho el jab, pelea a los lados y echa para atrás y no le da, no le da lo que entre. He says that the adjustment that Joshua can make is use his, his advantage, his physical advantage to be able to box and keep him on the outside, use the jab, use the lateral movement so he could get out side to side and not to back up against the ropes because that was going to give Usyk the opening to attack him. So that is the adjustment to be a better boxer than he was in the first fight. Well, I, I'm honored to be able to talk to you and it's a great pleasure to see you at the fights and healthy and happy. And it's always a, a pleasure and an honor to speak Thank with you. you. Thank you for coming out. Thank Radio Raheem with Hands of Stone, Roberto Duran.